ready if you would like to, um, to do those rituals with us when that time comes in the service. Also, if you have a talit um, in your home, like I have one here, you're welcome to grab that as well if you'd like to use that to spread it over your family when we do, um, when we do the blessings over our children. Um, and if you want to see us bigger on your screen, um, there's a way to kind of uh, manage, manage that from your screen. If you're seeing us like in a line up and down on the right side of the screen, just to the left of that, there's this sort of invisible line that you can pull further over to the left or to the right. So just so you can, uh, so you can know you can adjust how you, how you see us as the service goes on. And I'll turn things over to Rabbi Friedman, who will tell us about our theme of Shalom for today. And you're on mute, Rabbi Friedman. Our theme is Shalom. The word Shalom, we know, means hello, and it means goodbye. But whenever we see somebody, either to say hello or goodbye, we also want to wish them peace. We want them to have a life that is filled with peace. And so we're going to sing about that. And then we're going to talk about some ways of bringing about shalom between people as we say to each other, Shabbat Shalom, because that means have a Shabbat of peace, have a peaceful Shabbat. And Imbam introduces us to Shabbat Shalom. And here we go, everyone, starting with Bim Bam. Bim Bam, Bim 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 Bam, Bim 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 Bam. Bim Bam, Bim 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 Bam, Bim 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 Bam. We're gonna do Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom, Hey Shabbat. Shabbat, 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 Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom, hey, Shabbat Shalom, hey, Shabbat, 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 Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat, 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 Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat, 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 Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom, hey, Shabbat Shalom. Hey, Shabbat, 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 Shalom. Let's all sway for Bim Bam. Bim Bam, Bim, Bim, Bim Bam. Bim, 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 Bim Bam. Cheery, Beery, Beery, Bim Bam. Bim, Bim, Bim Bam. Bim, 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 Bim Bam. Let's hear the Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. Hey, Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat 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 Shalom Shabbat Shalom Hey Shabbat Shalom Hey Shabbat 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 Shalom Beautiful! I saw some wonderful clapping going on. So everyone, I'm Cantor Gostein and I'm gonna point over this way on my screen. That's <laughs> Rabbi Friedman, and we're so happy to be with you guys for Shabbat. And we would love to hear from you. I see percussion, I see drumming going on. How wonderful. We would love to hear you got from you guys about wonderful things going on in your life this week or maybe in the past month since our last talk Shabbat. So please, you can unmute yourselves and, and share with us something nice going on in, in your life and maybe introduce yourself to the other folks in the group. Can you tell everyone who you are? So this is Elia. This is Rachel Lewin. Girls, can you think of some fun things that we did this week? Something special about our week that we want to tell our friends and Rabbi and Cantor? I don't know anything. You don't know anything? No. You got your loose tooth? <laughs> That's pretty exciting. We might need to think about it. Think about it a little bit. That's okay. The loose tooth is exciting. And if you <laughs> yeah. think of something else you want to share, please, please do. Okay, girls. Think is about there, it. Is there anyone else who has something that they'd like to share too? Oh, okay. Elia? 
My, my tooth is loose. We've got a lot of tooth stuff going on here. <laughs> yes, yes. I wonder when it's going to fall out. We'll see. Maybe maybe uh, next month you're going to tell us that you have a nice space to show us. We'll see. <laughs> yeah. All right. I don't know, to Mindy or June, anyone, anyone want to share something nice going on in your lives? Okay, we're, we're so grateful for all of the wonderful things in our lives and we're just thankful that Shabbat is here. So we're gonna sing a little bit about Shabbat being here. And you can clap your hands like this. Shabbat is here, Shabbat is here. I'm so glad that Shabbat is here. We can put up our candles like this. Candles burning bright, it's Friday night. I'm so glad that Shabbat is here. Shabbat is here, Shabbat is here. I'm so glad that Shabbat is here. Candles burning bright, it's Friday night. I'm so glad that Shabbat is here. Shabbat Shalom to Ima. Can everyone sing that with me? Because we're saying Shabbat Shalom to Mom and to Ima. Here we go. Shabbat Shalom to Ima. And we're going to sing Shabbat Shalom to Abba. Who's Abba? It's Dad. Shabbat Shalom to Abba. Let me hear that. Shabbat Shalom to Abba. We're going to sing Shabbat Shalom also to Saba. Let me hear you say Saba. And also to Savta. Everyone say Savta. Those are Grandpa and Grandma. So let's try Shabbat Shalom to Saba. Shabbat Shalom to Saba. And we'll do Shabbat Shalom to Savta. Shabbat Shalom to Savta. Shabbat is here. Shabbat is here. I'm so glad that Shabbat is here. Candles burning bright. It's Friday night. I'm so glad that Shabbat is here. Let's try again. Shabbat Shalom to Ima. Shabbat Shalom to Ima and Abba. Shabbat Shalom to Abba and Saba. Shabbat Shalom to Saba and Savta. Shabbat Shalom to Savta. Shabbat is here. Shabbat is here. I'm so glad that Shabbat is here. Candles burning bright. It's Friday night. I'm so glad that Shabbat is here. And have a good Shabbat. For the next part, we're going to have to roll our hands like this for the gilly, 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 gilly part. Gilly, 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 good Shabbat. Good Shabbat. Good Shabbat. Gilly, 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 good Shabbat. Good Shabbat again. Gilly, gilly. Shabbat, good Shabbat, good Shabbat, gilly, 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 good Shabbat, good Shabbat. I saw some hands rolling and some sticks rolling there. That was great. So now we are going to tap our heads like this, going biddy bum, biddy bum, biddy 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 bum, biddy bum, biddy 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 bum. And June, I saw you on your shoulders. Let's do those, our Ketefaim. Here we go. Biddy bum. Biddy bum, biddy 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 bum, biddy bum, biddy 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 bum, and let's roll those hands. Gilly 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 gilly, good shabbat, good shabbat, good shabbat. Gilly 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 gilly, good shabbat, good shabbat. One more time. Gilly 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 gilly, good shabbat, good shabbat, good shabbat. Gilly 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 gilly, good shabbat, good shabbat. Beautiful, everyone. And everyone can gather up their candles and their challah. If you got a challah and your uh, your uh, your grape juice, we're going to begin with lighting candles and reciting the candle blessing. So if you know the candle blessing and you have it there, otherwise just sing along with me and with the care. So we're going to turn the screen up. Look at that. We got candles. Oh, I see the Shabbat yeah. candles. Okay, we're going to do the blessing together. Hey, First, oh, you're, you're going to, you're going to hey, light them? Okay. And we're, <laughs> we're going to, once they're lit, we're going to bring the warmth of Shabbat like this 
into our lives. We're going to bring, we're going to, for some of us, we can bring that warmth all the way from the rabbi's house into our homes. All right, here we go. Achat, shtaim, shalosh. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech, Ha'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'u'
something a little different today and during our silent prayer we're going to just stay standing right where we are we're going to see a pretty picture on the screen that we're going to look at and we'll get to have just a time of just private prayer where you can think about the wonderful things in your lives the special people around you and after that we're going to we're just going to stay standing because after that we're going to get on our dancing shoes for a little dancing for Ose Shalom so ready getting ready for silent prayer a hot Shtaim Shalosh. And there's the picture. dancing. Everyone can come nice up close right now because Rabbi Freeman is going to share a story with us. Uh, this story is called One City and Two Brothers. And it Rabbi Friedman, there. it's a little hard to hear your, um, to hear your voice. Okay. I don't, know if you, I don't know if you can get your mouth a little closer to the microphone. Okay, we can do that. Great. So, this is the story of two brothers. And the two brothers share a field. And in the field, they grow wheat. And when you harvest wheat, when you gather wheat, you put it in sacks. And every year they would grow enough wheat for about 20 sacks. And they would split it evenly between the two of them because they were brothers. Well, it turns out that one of the brothers grows up and gets married and has many children. And so the brother that doesn't have any children, the other brother never gets married, doesn't have any kids. So the brother who doesn't have any children thinks to himself, hmm, I bet my brother could use more wheat than I have. And so I'm gonna give him three extra sacks. So he'll have 13 sacks and I'll have seven, but that'll be okay. So the brother who doesn't have a family, at least not an immediate family, goes and takes three sacks over to his brother late at night when it's all nice and quiet and nobody can see. And so he takes his three sacks to see and gives it to his other brother. Well, the brother that had a wife and kids says to himself, you know, when I get old, I'm gonna have kids who are gonna take care of me. My brother 
doesn't have any children and not a wife probably needs this wheat more than I do in the long run. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take three sacks and take it over to my brother who doesn't have a family so that there'll be something to take care of him in his old age. And he does exactly the same thing. Well, the, well, the brother who's married says to his wife, listen, I'll tell you what, we only got seven sacks this year because he'd given three sacks over to his other brother, right? And his wife goes out in the store, goes out in the storage area back there, and she says, wait a minute, you told me we only had seven. There's actually 10 here. How come? And the brother is puzzled because he gave three of the sacks to his other brother. And all of a sudden, they're back. And this goes on like two or three more times where each brother tries to give the other sacks of flour. And then one night, while they're each trying to give each other the sacks of flour, what happens is they run into each other in the middle of the field, trying to give flour to each other. And they see what's going on. And the brother with the wife explains to the younger brother, but I was giving you three extra sacks because you'll need it for your old age. And the brother who wasn't married said to the brother, but I was giving you three sacks because you've got a wife and kids and you need more wheat. And they realized that they were just showing love for each other and making peace with each other, shalom. And they embraced warmly and they realized that they were just reflecting in their own, they were just reflecting in what they were doing the love that they have for each other. What this story teaches us is that in order to create peace in this world, in order to be brothers and sisters in this world, we sometimes have to do things that really think about what the other person needs and not what we need. And the two brothers did exactly that. And then after that, every year they would farm together. And every year would be one of shalom, would be one of peace for, the, for themselves and for their families. We create peace when we look to help other people. And you know what? Sometimes, often, when we do that, other people look for ways to create peace with us. So we're going to sing about being friends and having peace amongst friends because the word shalom, we know, and chaverim are friends. And we're all on this Zoom hot Shabbat, chaverim, friends. So we're going to sing a song of peace amongst us as friends. Yes, shalom. and I love how when Rabbi mentioned how the brothers embraced, we saw two sisters on the screen embracing that was very sweet. <laughs> okay, so we are going to take our sign for Shalom, which is putting our hands, one facing the ceiling and one facing the floor, putting them together, putting our hands together, and then we're going to kind of flip them upside down and smush them out towards the floor, like that. So coming together like this, one from the top, one from the bottom. Flip them over and spread them out. That's the sign for shalom, for peace. And the sign for friends, you're going to take your two pointer fingers and put one on top of the other and hook them together. And then turn both of your hands facing the other direction, one facing the ceiling, one facing the floor, and hook your, hook your fingers together again. So it's going to be like this, starting with our hands together. Shalom. Whoops, I'm trying to get to the camera. Chaverim. Shalom. Chaverim. Shalom. Shalom. We're wishing peace to our friends. And then we're going to take the letter L and go like this and wave like that. I'll like, I'll see you later. Lehitraot. Lehitraot. And more peace. Shalom, shalom. I see some hands flying over that. Let's try again from the beginning with our shalom. Shalom, 
Chaverim, Shalom, Chaverim, Shalom, Shalom. Lehitra Ot, I'll see you again. Lehitra Ot, see you later. Lehitra Ot, two more Shaloms. Shalom, Shalom. And we're going to do it one more time. Shalom. Chaverim, Shalom, Chaverim, Shalom, Shalom, Lehitraot, 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 Shalom, Shalom. Wonderful. And the word lahitra ot means bye. <laughs> lahitra ot actually it means I'll see you later. It doesn't mean goodbye. It means I'll see you later. And so that's the idea is that we get to see each other later. And we're going to see each other later because we have services a little later on tonight at seven o'clock again on live stream. And we're going to that continues every Shabbat. Also, I want you to know that if you have an older brother or sister who's ready to go into religious school, it's time to register that. The registration link was open this week to register for religious school. And the more that we have, more of our children we have in religious school, the bigger the community and the greater community we can build, even while we're online, because that's where we're going to be at the beginning. So now's the time to take care of that religious school registration. Also, keep an eye out in the coming weeks, probably in the next couple of weeks, for all kinds of opportunities to find out about how we're gonna be celebrating the High Holy Days at Temple Beth Shalom. There's gonna be, there'll be an opportunity for you to, to speak directly to myself, Cantor Gostein, and Rabbi Steinman about the High Holy Days Keep an eye out for that opportunity as well. And part of High Holy Days is going to be taught Rosh Hashanah and taught Yom Kippur this year at 3.30 in the afternoon. Both days. So we got a lot coming up, and it's a wonderful time to connect and strengthen our connections with each other. So if you got some interest, I know there's at least one person who's got some interest in instruments around the house. I saw June going at it. But if you have some other instruments around your home, it's time to sing the Shamru, our Shabbat song, and do Kiddush and Motsi. Yes, and this is, I saw some percussion too that that would be great for. And I think we're just doing the chorus for this tonight, just to keep our timing uh, as we need to. So here we go. Vishamadu Shamiru then et hashab la sod et hashab le doro tamberito lam one more time with the chorus. Shamiru then et hashab la sod et hashab le doro tamberito lam. And let's get our kiddush ready. If you've got your cup, let's join together in the blessing for the wine. Baruch Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, Borei peri hagafen. L'chaim. Okay, and anyone who wants to, I'm going to invite you to unmute. It's going to be a little cacophonous. We're going to hear lots of singing at different times, but that's okay. We'll try to do our mozi blessing together if you want to unmute and sing with me It'll okay be a little delay but we'll just have fun with it ha mozi lechem in haaretz we give thanks to god for bread our voices rise in song together as our joyful prayer is said baruch atadonai Eloheinu melech haolam, 
Hamotzi lechem min haaretz b'teyavon. You want to buy it? Oh, I see people taking some challah. Yummy. Girls, you want to tell them about this challah? Tell them about the challah? What's, what's the story with your challah? We made it ourselves. Oh, wow. It was a little Wonderful. project. Oh, it's That's lovely. Amazing. And Jew's got a piece of challah I see down there too. Oh, yum. Yay. <laughs> well, Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Thank you so much for joining in Tat Shabbat. Thank you. Thank you both. So much fun to be able to spend Shabbat with you. Oh, thank you. Girls, can you say thank you? They're just uh, munching away. Good. That's good. That's what you should be good. doing after the mozi. Thank you. And thank you, Marissa, for being, for taking yes. care of the slides for us tonight. And yes, yeah. uh, as always. So Shabbat Shalom, everybody. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat shalom.